This is Michael with Silicon Valley Global News. I am here at AWE, the Augmented World Expo, talking to Noah from Naves, Noah Eckhouse from Naves, and he's walking around doing a 3D capture of, uh, of, the, of the Expo Hall. And uh, Noah, would you tell us uh, a little bit about uh, Naves and, and what your technology does? Yeah, I'd be happy to. Okay. So I work for a company, Navis. We're based in Munich, Germany. We've got offices all over the world. And what we do is we're a, a hardware and software company, though software primarily, because we don't build our own LiDAR sensors. We take those off the shelf and we get the most out of them. So we build a rapid capture for you know high high fidelity reality capture. Yep. Um, we've got a device here. I'm actually wearing it right now. This yep. is the Navis VLX. The Navis VLX. So this has got two LiDAR sensors on it, one yep. vertically oriented, one horizontal. Okay. There's those four cameras around the top. So as I'm walking around at walking speed, I'm going to be capturing LiDAR data up to 600,000 points per second. And then I'm also going to be capturing panoramic imagery wherever I see fit. So, so I can he, capture that every meter, every five meters, whatever is good for the project. So we're talking about uh, point clouds that have billions of points. We are. So uh, we can work with any size point cloud effectively. And we're going to be capturing, as I mentioned, up to 600,000 points per second. And since you can capture for an hour continuously, as you can imagine, it becomes quite voluminous. So we do spatially decimate that until we've got a consistent five millimeter resolution. And so what you end up with is, for the area, you've got a very high fidelity, but also light weight point cloud to represent everything that you need. Okay. And so the customers can obviously export this point cloud and they can do their own uh, you know, deep learning on this to connect the points and to, to identify objects and to classify that. That's on the customer side for, as an option for them to do with the scan once they have worked with your company. Did your company uh, stream this technology? Uh, over the web to the customers, and like the, like the full file. Yeah. So we do have a cloud platform, and so you can upload and process concurrently up to a thousand data sets. And so it really takes the takes the need for having a 256 gig RAM machine dedicated to processing. Because I, in my hotel room yesterday, uploaded an hour of capture, and it processed overnight. This morning I woke up, and I was looking at Castro Theater, and I was looking at the Conservatory of Flowers. Uh, you know, half a day after I captured it. So you mentioned that. You you are doing automatic decimation uh, uh, on, the, on the server side, is it possible for customers to get the raw data? So the raw data is something that we don't offer, and uh, the reason being is that we are uh, we, we believe heavily in the extra context provided via colorization, mm -hmm. and so one of those things is that we are very, uh, very serious about colorization, as in every single point. We're taking up to seven different images that saw that point. We're getting our RGB values and blending them. And so we're gonna do that after we filter it down and decimate it so that we're not spending days processing for all of these points that may not be the best representation of the scene. Sure, um, who, who are your customers? What is the, uh, the, ball, the ballpark? Uh, yeah. Well, we range, the, we run the gamut from the, you know, the BMWs and the Daimlers and uh, all of those types of auto manufacturing facilities. Uh, groups like Siemens, and then down to the smaller mom and pop shops, land surveyors, reality capture professionals, um, architects, engineers, even construction firms. So really, it's, uh, it's if you've got a need for laser scanning and sub centimeter accuracy is your goal, we can speed up your life significantly. So anybody who's in that realm, they'll come to us for for that content. So your website will be is that is that going to be at uh, navis. Navis.com exactly. Thanks, for, thanks so much for, for stopping by. Yeah, my pleasure. Bye.